Hi guys, welcome back to a new video. If you're new here, my name is Anushka. So today, we're back for another Amazon haul. You guys really liked my previous one, so I'm just gonna do another because, again, I've been buying a bunch of stuff and I think I've made some good discoveries. One not so good, but I'll tell you guys why. I'm gonna start off with the one that I'm most excited about and it's tea. I got a bunch of tea 2 teas. I actually originally got one, which was the Jade Mountain Tea and it tastes amazing. I don't know how dark tea on its own can taste like there's milk in it. Like it literally tastes like there's milk in it. It's like a an, a back taste. I don't know how to explain it. But this tastes amazing. It's flavoured green tea in a bag. It's got a little bit of sugar, hazelnut, cocoa, blackberry leaves, chicory root, almonds, and obviously green tea. But it's very, very nice. It reminds me sometimes of like the bubble teas I would get. I also got a peach one and it's really, really nice on its own. It's a little sweet, but the sweetness is so subtle. And then I also got a black chai one. I haven't tasted the black chai, I'm gonna have it later, but I've been really pleased with the peach and the Jade Mountain one. They taste amazing. And I always used to go past like a T2 shop when I used to work on my beauty counter and Bobbi Brown and I would never like go in and try it. I've been really pleased and I've been trying to cut down on coffee i haven't had coffee in like weeks now and i'm going more for like green teas and just natural teas as well they honestly have been so nice and yummy but for the tea i actually got this uh rapid tea maker um just to kind of like brew your tea in here and then it's so cool i put a clip you put your tea in the in this um contraption thing and then you let it brew and then when you place it over a cup it kind of pours out it's so good the only downside is to this it's kind of too big for one cup but too small for two cups it's a bit annoying but i still really like this i'm really glad i bought it it's so easy to clean it's dishwasher safe so i put it in a dishwasher and it works completely fine and i'm so glad i have this my mom's been obsessed my even my brother likes it my sister's not too much of a fan but it's re if you really like teas and green teas and stuff like that you need this it's so so good by the way just a tip um, my mum always keeps um, these yankee candle jars and we clean them out and then we put the tea bags in here so it's airtight sealed and it's a pretty storage for your tea bag really convenient guys oh my little guy she's purring so loud right now oh you happy guy are you happy Okay, now on to the next thing. I got a cake leveler cutter kind of thing because I've been so into baking lately and I really want to do my rainbow cake. Um, I got this. It's huge and it was actually really affordable on Amazon and it works really well because I've already tested it out. So yeah, I got this. Really random, but I thought I'd put this in there. <laughs> the next thing we've got is some um, workout contraption thing. And it's basically like a band like this. And you can tie this on a door and it's this one's nine kg so it's hard i'm struggling to do this but we put our foot in it and then you put your foot in it and you kind of like lift it up like this or like you can go like this too and it's the hardest thing ever and i need to work out my arms a bit more i need upper body strength um so yeah this one this thing is really really good really pleased with this the next thing i actually got is this poly gel nail set it was really affordable i think it was like 10 pounds or something and i did my nail my nail video will probably be up by now so i'll link it in info box if you guys want to check it out but i thought i put it in here because i recently wore this on amazon and it worked really well for me and i managed to do like full-on acrylic nails at home by myself by myself so yeah i got this it's really good i'm not too fond of the colors but um i think going forward i'm gonna just use this to give my nails length and then put gel colors on top i then also got this brush set for my more like creative looks they're super precise especially like these ones i can even use these to do nail art on my nails um but yeah, I thought like I needed more precise brushes. I also wanted to just quickly mention this electric nail filer. I love this. It works amazingly. The file is so stable when you go even at a really high speed. This was actually sent to me. I didn't buy it. I was going to buy one originally for my nails. But the, the brand actually contacted me to send me this one. And I have really enjoyed it. I do have a coupon code that you guys can use. I'll leave it in the info box. 
Um, I don't get commission from it. I wish I did, to be honest, but I don't. I prefer to give you guys a higher discount so you can get as much money off on this. So yeah, if you if you like doing your nails at home, I definitely recommend this. This is really good. It's very high quality. It's definitely more of an investment, but I'm really glad I got this. And I was gonna buy one anyway, so just it's perfect timing. Then I got some kind of like gems to use for like makeup or even sometimes on my nails if I feel like putting like rhinestones and stuff. So um, you've got like tweezers to pick them up and a little pencil to make your marking. Just a cute little set like this. Very handy. I just needed this in my life. The next I also got a nailing glue. I got these for my nails in case I want to glue rhinestones on them. I just keep justifying my purchases. Did I really need this? I think I did. This has been so amazing. So I just feel like I cannot go away from gel nail polish ever again now that I have everything at home. And I got this cute uh, gel nail polish set on Amazon. It was so affordable. I think it was like £17 and you get like six in there. And they're like pastel shades. So I did my sister's nails with them and they're really good. They last really long. Um, but the only thing is you need three coats for these colours, um, which is fine, but they just last amazingly. The colours are very like pastel-y um, and you get like yellow and lilac, pink, blue, green and like a nude peach. If you like doing your nails, you need this. The only thing is the pain is that you need three coats, but like once you've done the three coats, it looks so pretty and it lasts long. So I thought I'd share this with you guys. I did share on my Insta stories and so many of you bought it and said you liked it. So I'm glad when you like my recommendations, guys, but I definitely need to get some more shades of these. This is so random, but we got some cleaning wipes for like our iPad phones like LCD screens, just anything that needs cleaning because sometimes when I look at my screens, they're horrendous. So yeah, these come in like little sachets. It was really affordable and I needed it. So the next thing I got is this uh, ring light. It's like a mini ring light and I got this especially for TikTok. I saw it on TikTok and I thought, wow, I really need this so that I have like a phone stand in a corner with a light ready to go when I, went, when I want to film TikToks. But I was so disappointed by this. So it was like £50 that I paid this for. Um, and I'll put a clip here of like what it looks like. But the ring light is like this big, like it's small. It's not as bright as I would want it to be. But the tripod is the most flimsiest thing I've ever tried in my life. It's so frustrating. So yeah, I'm returning this guys. I'm so disappointed by it. And the ring light needs to be brighter. I feel like if you're starting out, it'll be great. Like it still does work. But for me, it's too frustrating. Like I need something stable that will stay in place. The light is not that bad. I'm exaggerating, but it's not as bright as my LED square light. So I'm not getting the light that I need. And it was really frustrating. So not happy with that okay and then the last and final thing which is so random i needed cream of tartar basically really good if you're gonna do like meringue but i needed it for my pandan cake to practice because my pandan cake kept collapsing and this just made the huge difference i realized you don't need too much of it because it has a weird taste um so yeah i got a big tub of it i've just been avoiding going out shopping so much and the thing is i don't know if i will find this when i go to tesco the baking aisles are like empty in every like shop I've been to or like superstore so um I got this on Amazon that's my Amazon haul I hope you enjoyed this one I know um I got some random bits but the teas were definitely by far like my most best purchase from Amazon and the tea maker um I definitely recommend it to you guys and yeah if you do want more of these let me know in the comments below please do like this video and subscribe if you haven't already and let me know in the comments below what you've been buying is there something that you've discovered that I, you feel like I need as well let me know in the comments anyways I'll see you in my next video bye guys